Happy Meal! Yay! Oh, I have been so excited to do this one. And this one is is long, long overdue. Um, but as per usual, things happen and I just haven't had time and life takes over and life sucks sometimes. I'd rather be doing Happy Meals. <laughs> anyway, here I am. So excited about this one. Um, I'm not actually going to go into very much detail about this one. I'm going to leave that to you to go over links below and check Moira McDonald's channel out, YouTube channel out. Specifically, um, the link below, which is the link to the flip through of this journal. Because, um, for those of you who do know, the fellow junk journalers, Moira McDonald is a junk journaler as well as a card maker. Um, I previously did a Happy Mail video for Moira on some cards that I purchased from her. Um, but I also asked her, oh, before Christmas, um, if she'd make me a journal, a junk journal. Um, the only stipulation was I wanted it to be Scottish themed. <laughs> because going to Scotland is like my highlight of the year holiday wise. Um, I love it up there. Myself and Thoud Man go up there every year for our wedding anniversary. I'm just going to move you up a little bit. Um, our wedding anniversary is in April. We usually go later in the year. But yeah, <coughs> mainly because the weather's better. Um, but I love it up there. It's like going up there is like finding my going toward traveling towards my happy place. Um, so yeah, so I thought, what better way to um document that's the word trying to think of the words what better way to document a scottish holiday than in a scottish themed journal so yep she did what i asked exactly what was asked of her and she made me an awesome journal and then she sent extras so but this is obviously i don't have the envelope anymore um i actually took them out of the envelope and discharge uh, discharged got rid of the envelope so saved space i have happy meals mounting up all over the place um but yeah so oh, i love the bags that they come in they can be reused but this is the journal and oh my gosh it is amazing amazing i love it i love 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 it i actually did watch the um flip through before she sent me the journal so I knew what it looked like before it came but oh it's amazing it couldn't oh seriously just amazing <laughs> so I'm just going to get to it like I said I'm not going to go into everything in detail because I think you should definitely go over to Moira's channel and check out her version of the flip through I'm sorry guys I cannot get this tripod right today I am in a different location desk wise um uh, well not even desk wise it's the same desk um you don't see this paper very often this is what's underneath my craft mats um i am in the bedroom still but i am not the desk used to be the desk is now this way up against the wall next to the bed where before it used to be that way just this way the window is here and instead of the desk being here and the window at the side the desk used to be where the window is there it used to be just over here behind me <laughs> So the lighting is a bit rubbish. I didn't realise when I moved over here how it's not so bad now because the sun's shining through. But before when I used to video over there, the window was like here in front of me. So all the light was immediately on the desk. Now the light's coming from the side and it's a bit dark and dingy at times. Luckily, sun's shining right now. So, but yeah, this is awesome. I love this. Love, love, love this. So we start off with this gorgeous little kilt pin and a bead dangle. Beautiful. Look at the way that's shining in the light. Stunning. And some crochet, I believe crocheted lace as a closure. So it's held together with this, which is a um, collaged button got a thistle on it so cute which i definitely think moira she asked in her um 
her flip through video if anybody would like to see her making some more of these collage buttons to let her know and I definitely think you should do them not collage decoupage sorry not collage um decoupage and I definitely think you should do a tutorial on them Moira that'd be awesome it's so cool I love it I love the colours too um but yeah so that's just held in there with the lace and a nice bead dangle on the kilt pin I love the kilt pin awesome nice little <coughs> attention to detail there um but yes so if she's done it as a bit of a franken tag collage style cover all scottishy themed with some um washi tapes some music paper from Alt lang syne and books and then she stamped this stamp of scotland on there which is awesome it's just so cool and yeah so and there we go another scotland stamp now she said she actually said in her flip through that she stamped that but i'm not sure whether she colored it either or whether she's used blue ink or whether she stamped it and then colored it because i've seen her do that before where she'll stamp something and then she colors it in herself but she never said so i don't know but i love i don't know how well it's picking up because of the light but i love the fact that it's got hints of pink in it as, as well because the um what word, what's the word for it not stipulations but I told her she had free reign of everything, whatever she did, but it's got to be Scottish themed and I love pink and blues, like pinks and turquoises, blues and butterflies. <laughs> so, but yeah, she certainly, certainly did her job, uh, not did her job, but certainly met the criteria for that. I love this. It folds out the little hearts and then it folds out into like a little claw relief. So cool. Yeah. So some um I think she said that was sticker, like washi tape sticker, and then some stamping, the same on that side. So cool. A little tag. Um I'm not sure if this was one that she made on video. There's a couple in here that she actually made. I think the tag I think the tags were anyway. I know some of the clusters in here were made on uh, in tutorial videos. I love this. Love this eyelash trim. All multicoloured. Beautiful colours in there. You really need to let me know where you got that from, Moira. I love it. But yeah, so gorgeous tag. Copy dyed paper on the back and then some journaling space. A thistle stamp there which she probably no she's used coloured ink for that some quartz I love that in Scotland there is no such thing as bad weather only the wrong quartz that is true <laughs> yep although I must admit in all fairness the times we've been up there and we've been up there a lot in the last ooh, well we've been going up there probably probably about four maybe five years now we haven't really had re that bad weather, so I can't grumble, really can't grumble. But to be honest, from what I've noticed when we're up there, it's no different than down here either, so <laughs> maybe a little bit colder up there, but the scenery makes it all worth it. So, little paper doily, tiny doily, another Scotland stamp, little more pink in there, Scottish um, tartan banner. And of course she knew, I told her I wanted this as like a um, diary type journal and she's embossed days of the week on pages and I didn't tell her that we were going up on a Saturday but she's actually started the journal from a Sunday which is awesome because a lot of them start Mondays, a lot of them start on Mondays. Well, this one starts on Sunday, which is cool because that's the day after we get there. The day that we go up there, it's like a six to eight hour journey for us from here. Um, so we don't do anything once we get there. We're staying in a self-catering apartment. 
um, all we do is we get there, we check in, and then we usually go shopping just round the corner to Morrison's. Um, is it Morrison? Morrison's? It's in Morrison's. I always say Sainsbury's. I'm sure it's Morrison's. <laughs> um, yeah, and we go and buy stuff in for the week or just for the couple of days anyway, and then we go back to the apartment, make tea. And, well, actually, we usually go to the, the chippy around the corner for tea. And then just go back in the apartment and chill until the day after I would jail. So really our week up there begins on Sunday. So that's awesome that that starts on Sunday. And this is one of the clusters that she did. Um, I'm pretty sure she did this cluster in a tutorial that she did. I'm not positive she did. But anyway, so we have another page. This book also is um, four by six inches. So it's a good size, especially one to be carrying around while you're on holiday. Excuse me. Nice plain page there. A um, craft coloured piece of paper there that she has stamped on and then embossed in white, which is cool because it kind of, it's weird. Because it kind of almost feels like plastic, that embossing. But yeah, it's cool because still right on the back. Excuse me. Another thistle stamp. Another quote. Every man dies, not every man really lives. William Wallace. Oh, we got hiding in there. Come out, come out. <laughs> so yet we have another tag, which is cute. I'm really, really loving this lace. Eyelash trim. Another collage tag. Loving the pink highlights in it. So cool. Again, coffee dyed paper on the back. The journaling space. Obviously journaling space there as well. And this is so cute. I absolutely love this. It's a heart. She's done some stamping of a thistle there. Little moments. But because she knows I like my butterflies. <laughs> so cute so cute I know I'm easily pleased but that just really made me go squeal like oh that's so cute when I watched her video <laughs> but yeah it is it is just so cute though piece of vellum which is cool and then some bagpipes stamped bagpipes and then she has used a like a rose gold bronzy coloured paper clip to hold this in well it's not holding but it's to hold it shut and this is um, again washi tape and stickers I believe little concertina thing um, and then on the back it's got like graph paper on the back so you can still journal on it One, two, three, four, five. so there's five spaces there which would be well sort of like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday we get up there on Saturday we don't really do anything till Sunday and then we come home again on the Saturday so yeah Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday would be handy for just quick little snippet notes and um, again another piece of Titan. Not sure if that's wash. Yeah, I think that's washi tape. Oh, bear with me. Just knock the paper clip off on the floor. So yeah, love that little element. Clip that back on. Then on this side we have a piece of Titan material, tipping as she calls it. I'd say fabric flip, but you know, same thing basically. Uh, so you could journal under there, put like a photograph or a bit of secrecy or whatever under there and then she's added some lace to it for a bit of extra bling. <laughs> and I love this page. I think in the whole of the book, this is one of my favourite pages. I really do love this page. I love everything about this page. So she's stamped that, she's coloured it in and I love the way that even the paper before she's done the stamping is got a mark on it there from where something else has been sat on top of it when she coffee dyed it and then all the pink in it too it's just I love everything about this page 
it's awesome and she did say i'm pretty sure she said oh you know what you could journal around it but i'm not going to do that's just going to be there like my own moira piece of art i love it and then we get to monday so we've had quite a busy day on sunday <laughs> and again another little cluster so there's a ticket a um, piece of vellum that she's embossed monday onto a flower some more music paper behind some tartan a quart just trying to read that i think i need my glasses to read that i'll put it there anyway you guys will probably be able to read that i need to put my glasses on to read that um but yeah nice bit of bling in the middle there oh oh i'm out of focus again now whoops there we go another quote from smito i'm not going to go into detail about that but she explained moira explains all about that in her journal flip through so go on over to her channel and check that out i love that this is a good this is quite a well used quote here as well speak of the devil and he's sure to appear we use that saying here oh it's a scottish saying but we use that saying a lot um yeah another stamp there again another cluster love these love these love everything about it and a little pink glittery in the background as well on near enough every page look at that little tiny tag that is so cute another piece of lace and a tuesday banner oh love it love it i love these little clusters because each one's like a like i said again like a piece of moira art <laughs> brilliant nice page to write on nice little stamp i love how unusual these stamps are i love quirky and fun things i love them colors awesome i love tartan and i love them colors i love that little lace as well i love everything about this book i just love 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 it <laughs> again another thistle stamp and then we're on to wednesday cool another ticket and some other stuff and butterfly mm. stop watching if we're now we've got to the middle of the book and then she's got these two little beads on the bottom which are gorgeous it's got little roses in them they are like um Oh, do you know I always say it wrong? Millifiori, or uh, however you say it, I always get them wrong. But they're kind of sparkly as well. To me, they look like faceted beads. Yeah, they're definitely faceted beads anyway. Um, but yeah, gorgeous. I love them them style beads. But yeah, a stopwatch, and then a couple of blank pages again. That stamp again in a different colour. <laughs> Another. Um, cluster <laughs> couldn't think of it then and um, we're on to Thursday butterfly shield love it all tartan amazing and Moira's pretty much signature um, little signature envelope and tag there's either an envelope or like a little mini letter or something in there she puts them in all her journals it's awesome again another page where something's obviously been over the top of it as she's coffee dyed it or as it's been drying anyway don't know if that's picking up because of the light but this page is actually sparkling i can't win today with the light it's either too dark because it's raining or the sun's shining and it's too bright but yeah another thistle stamp and then over to the next page where there's um another pocket oh honestly i'm losing my words today i like the way she's done this as well she's sewn around it but she's only sewn it onto the bottom so it's more a tuck than a pocket but yeah and then we have some more tags with her tim holtz freaky people <laughs> i believe she calls them um i, I do i do agree though they are they're kind of cute but some of them really are a bit freaky um i don't have any actually but yep more eyelash trim i love this eyelash trim 
so yeah another tag for journaling on love that another tag with some bits of collage now she's also embossed this one which is cool some right on the back of there, of there as well just tuck them in there Oops. again like I said all these sayings and quotes and stuff get on over to her channel and she explains them I'm not going to go through all that I don't because I do really think you should go over and check her video out and then another one <laughs> another one definitely true another cluster and now we're on to Friday so cool I love it and my Scotty dog I love Scotty dogs I really really do it's like every time we play Monopoly if I can't be the Scotty dog I refuse to play <laughs> I'm so childish I'm not playing unless I can be the dog I've done that since I was a kid as well but yeah love that another thistle stamp there's a lot of room in this journal, there really is. Another tartan banner. A piece of vellum. A sun in a different colour. Another collage, a uh, cluster, again with a Scotty dog. I love that colour tartan, it's gorgeous. A banner matching, some other bits and bats matching the same. Yep, I love everything about it. And the other side to that um, craft paper with another banner and some more of the embossed stamping it's weird how that feels kind of rubbery a typewriter stamp a post office stamp uh, post box post office stamp made me laugh like, because she said in her video about um, getting to this bit and reminding me to send postcards home and things like that which um, I don't do <laughs> I buy them whenever we go on holiday wherever I can find them I will buy them but I don't post them home I just take them home <laughs> and then we are on to this one again another tag my collage cluster tag another embellished one as well room on the back another freaky people <laughs> Love the colours again, some bits of pink in the coffee dye paper on the back to be able to use. Another tuck. Actually put that one that way and then it hangs out that side. Then we have oh, more butterflies. Gorgeous. Another butterfly. Again, another um, signature tiny envelope. There's room for another tiny tag. The other doily, another piece of tartan there, love it. And then the back page, I love that, I love the way she's just gone over it. And this is, I really don't think it's showing, oh it might be a bit there, it's sparkly. Love that, gotta love the sparkles. And that's it for the journal, it's absolutely awesome, I love it. I love everything about it, I really really do. wrap that round there yes I really really do I love everything about it and then as if that weren't enough she sent an extra package of goodies so let's have a look at this I really wasn't expecting this but yeah again in another bag which is awesome because I can use the bag and we have an awesome embellished envelope almost like a stuffed pocket envelope it's just amazing look at it look at all the detail in it lace and trims and i love that from the heart bless amazing and all the tim holtz creepy girl a bit of stamping in the background some embossing oh i love it i just love everything about it again this is some embossing there awesome there's a um, can't find my words today a piece of paper there anyway like a diary that's it a 
diary note thing, which is cool. Now, apparently, she said about these kind of being extras, obviously, for the journal, that she couldn't get into the journal, but also to help, like, when we're out and about. This is cool. I love this. Another cute embossed envelope. I love the shape of the top of it. That's cool. I love the fact that there's a little bit, little bit of tartan to look like a stamp. <laughs> awesome and then this has little bits in it extras um, in case you needed them Crack them out and they've got it's the vellum with the days of the week on in case I needed us some more I love that little tag shape one yes yeah, so or just in case like I said we needed some more a like a book plate style one and then we have some cutouts of words this one says discover and then this one says adventure which is also really cool but also besides adding these into the big diary if necessary there's another one in here a little one so these would be really cool for that, which I think is what these are intended for anyway, to be honest. Let's try and get them back in there without damaging them. So we have a cute little envelope. Again, another tag. Loving these little tags. Another tag. She's pretty lady. Again, coffee dyed paper on the back. Another tag. I love this because I'm pretty sure it is. I'm pretty sure that is the same thing she used to decoupage the button with. So that's cool with it ties in. That's just been done on craft paper card. Still can be journaled on. And then we've got some bigger tags, which is cool. Again, on craft loving them I like these bigger style tags not very many people tend to do these they always stick to the like traditional usual style ones but I like the bigger ones and the weird shaped ones so yeah I'm loving all these extra tags definitely so really cool and then look she's made a cute little tiny journal more a notebook she said more along the lines of putting this in my bag kind of thing and just taking quick notes while we're out and about on days out and she put my initial on it that's so cool awesome but yeah and then just some bits of paper in that can be quickly written over like she said more a, a notebook style book to throw in my bag and when we're out and about gallivanting and quickly jot notes down she stapled this one um, quickly jot notes down in to then transfer over into the big journal when we get back which is definitely useful so cool so cool I love it and I really wasn't expecting the extras so that is a really cool bonus I love that so cute little journal and the extras so thank you so so much Moira um, I just love everything about it I really really do You've gone above and beyond what I asked of you. Um, yeah, I love it when I, I... I do quite a lot, unless I have something specific in mind when I'm, ask, when I'm like asking for a custom of anybody, journal or otherwise. Um, I love giving the creator creative freedom with it because... You can be yourself more when you know you do like when you've got full reign yourself if you're given a list of strict instructions i think it's a bit harder to be more creative because you're always then concerned of oh am i going to meet the criteria is it going to be good enough well you know i mean you do that anyway even when you're not following strict instructions but i just find it i don't know i prefer people to have put their own creative spin on things so yeah and you definitely did that Moira definitely I absolutely love it I absolutely do I really really do love it and I've said it before um probably in passing comments or whatever but I will be back for another one at some stage because it won't take me long when we go up there to fill that in 
and then we'll be up there again at some other stage too so I can see me probably getting one a year <laughs> oh, but yeah awesome I love it absolutely love it love the bags too because I can reuse them cheeky but you know <laughs> but yeah amazing 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 so oh I love everything about it you excelled yourself it's awesome absolutely no need to be worried about whether I like it or not because I do I absolutely love it there's nothing about it I don't like it's amazing I love everything so thank you so so much I seriously seriously encourage you guys to pop on below to the description and check out the links to Moira's video at uh, Moira's YouTube channel and via that you can find her on Etsy as bygone zero um but yeah so seriously guys go and check her out go and check her videos out she does some amazing tutorials um you'll be able to see some of these how they were made as well the tags and stuff as well as like i said get on over there and see the moira's flip through of the journal because that's well worth a watch too um and she goes through things in more detail so but yeah it's just amazing i love it so much thank you millions um and yeah thank you guys for watching um and i will see you again soon in a different video so thank you again for watching thank you maura you're amazing and i'll see you soon guys goodbye